lived my oh, my whole life basically in the cinema, even to the point I'm going to live at the Empire Arena as a chief projectionist. I fell in love with the cinema when I used to go with mum and dad to the, the, the King's Cinemas on Nashfield. And uh, I, I, now I never used to watch the film, I, I used to keep turning around to see where the ray of light was coming from. Mm -hmm. And father got a little bit annoyed with me because I was spoiling the programme for them. <laughs> so when, I, when the programme finished, he said, I'm going to ask the manager if I can show you, if he'll let you have a look around. Anyway, I went, I went up into the projection room and I was mesmerised. I asked him if I could go up and, and basically do the uh, help in the uh, projection room. And I used to do uh, rewinding. I used to take rewind of reels and then take the next part. University of Colorado. I love the actual showing films, like putting the film on, uh, just watching the wheels go around, popping down and watching the audience's reaction to the mm -hmm. films. This was in the, the old ABC, it was in a cabinet. Well, before it closed, I, I, I thought, well, I'll, I'll have that as a souvenir. And I'll see what it's like. And where it is, it's, it's a film all about building the M1. <laughs> what was the last film you saw in the cinema? I don't know, but I never used to watch them. <laughs> in fact, the, the manager, I once said to the manager, I said, uh, I've, I've never ever sat and watched a film in, in the cinema. And the manager, Peter Jackson, he said, you ought to be ashamed of yourself. But I'm not interested. I'm more interested in the workings. I mean, and, and just to know that you're the, you're the professional putting on a show for people to sit and enjoy. This trombone out of Hocken right away, he wants to buy a hundred dollar necklace. Oh, God. Yes, well, I'd like to give her something nice. I haven't seen it for a couple of years. You are engaged, eh? No? Around together so you'd never write a film? University of no. You'd never write a film? No. I'm not, I'm not that intelligent. <laughs> <laughs>